for Kate. Listen. Someone sang a prayer in a locked bathroom. Peculiar, this attempt to offer syllables as if to tell of her. This mumbling under thunder. This candle lit for that spectacle which ends not with a curtain falling, but a thunderbolt from a cloudless sky. Oh, that the sky were cloudless. There is no minor violence. Just as there is no negligible cough during an aria. Visitors are welcomed to the school of lost tongues. History, by changing its name, is the hero or heroine of this story. I comb my mind for images and find women from some millennium gone. Their fingers singing in berries must have been. Etruscan cloth hampered in the wind, blowing violet wisps of their hair gathered in the manner of their mothers, of their grandmothers, with brooches lifted from the land. Just think not to be committed to any law of dissolution. Consider the parlance of women battered as proverbs. Listen. She is running into the rain, a swaddled nova in her arms. The screen door like a jaw snaps behind her. Listen. She is weaving a prayer in her hands like a basket. No crack of the tusk, voice of the angry man, shall touch. Peculiar, this attempt to ascribe brushstrokes to elephants. Peculiar, this star, this candle flame in the open sky at dusk. Peculiar, 